Hi everyone, this is Video Reborn. This video is about the introductions and demonstrations for the PlayStation Move controllers for the um, Resident Evil 5 Gold Edition. What I'm going to tell you that is Capcom has made a decision to only support Move controllers for the Gold Edition and does not support any regular edition via any patches. Okay, um, So once you popped in the GOAT edition into the PlayStation 3 over there, you will experience an update, okay? The update is a patch for the um, motion controller support. Capcom has specifically stated that the regular edition lacks certain kind of memory allocation for the PlayStation Move. So um, there is no patches at all um, for you to play or to use the move controllers. So I don't know if Capcom is actually uh, trying to uh, force the consumers to buy the Gold Edition, but um, well, the fact is the fact, only Gold Edition is supported. So no more regular edition, all right? So now, uh, a lot of people might ask, um, well, since the DualShock 3 also support for the uh, control on the left side, for the analog stick and the uh, regular, um, you know, the uh, D-pad, the, the trigger buttons, okay? Well, sh should I spend another $29.99 to purchase the uh, PlayStation, uh, PlayStation Move navigation controller? Well, I would say maybe you should go ahead if you plan on playing uh, blockbuster games or hardcore games like Resident Evil or the upcoming uh, Killzone 3 and Mac and many many other uh, upcoming games okay the reason it's because um, holding the DualShock 3 controller on the left side makes you feel very unbalanced and uh, I think you have to hold your controller to your left side and test it out if you are really able to uh, endure that inconvenience okay using the navigation controller it's way more comfortable okay it comes with a d-pad uh, a cross sign a circle sign analog stick trigger one and trigger two for the left side okay and there's a ps button there's no start or select button on the other hand the playstation move controller does have this select start the uh, R1 button, but they call it the uh, whatever move button, square, triangle, circle, and cross. And the PS button, start button, and finally, the trigger button. See that? The trigger button. Alright, so it looks like a glorified Wii mode, but let me tell you the accuracy of this baby. It's amazing. Alright, it's perfect. It's Basically, what whatever we lacks, the PlayStation Moves is able to solve it, but do a lot better. The reason is with this ball, all right, it comes with the proximity, okay? The closer you are toward the TV or the camera, it recognizes it as the closer you are, okay? And when you go farther, it recognizes you going farther. Move forward, move backward. So the basic... Um, explanation it's since it's a circular spherical shape right regardless of uh, how I rotate it when you look at a camera it doesn't changes it's regardless of the orientation but the transformation you know the uh, enlargement here it get closer it's a larger circle when it's further it's a smaller circle so uh, when the LED light turns on that means uh, the camera is able to read it and readjust it the color of this uh, globe uh, depending on the environment okay depending on the uh, lighting you know all the lighting here all right um, so it changes okay and um, so this is the basic uh, computer vision 101 all right for people who doesn't know anything about uh, uh, computer vision and let's do it all right let's do Resident Evil 5 PlayStation Move Control Demonstration Okay, by Video Reborn Okay, now I am going to press the center button uh, The Move button, okay 
So Resident Evil to pair controller with the motion controller firmly press the left stick. So I have the navigator controller, okay? Press the left stick. And then if the motion controller is not res re responding properly, hold it horizontally and aim it at the PlayStation Eye. So I'm trying to aim it at the PlayStation Eye, okay? So you see this um, reddish glow. It's you can't really see it, okay? So let me put it to a very very dark place. Then you will see it, okay? It's a glowing red cyan color, okay? So it recognizes it. It loads successful, all right? So there you go. A camera. So you can actually do the basic computer vision right now. See, it's it's cool, man. And using by holding the trigger button, you can uh, choose the um, menu, the cursor, just like an air mouse, like an iPhone 4 gyroscope. It's the same thing. Okay, now let's go to the play games. And then you press the uh, the move button, okay? Let's see, every time when I press the trigger, it, it resets the location. So I can put it horizontally and point it and aim it, see? Or I can do it vertically and press the trigger button and I can also aim, so it's cool, you know. It resets every time when I trigger it. All right. Now, let's try it, man. Let me put it on the uh, camera mount here. All right, guys. Let's try this. Let's try it, man. Okay. PlayStation Move controller and the PlayStation Move navigation. All right. Now I'm going to play continue. All right. So I will just go whatever, start, start. Um, and then I can use the D-pad or I can hold the uh, trigger button and press the home a move button say yes all right cool huh yeah okay now again it the controls it's almost the same as the Wii Resident Evil 4 so using the left analog stick you do the uh, running I mean the moving and then press X you run back and X you turn 180 degrees and when you try to aim you can either hold the left trigger or you can uh, actually hold the right trigger and then you can aim like that you see that or I can do that aim you know it's deadly accurate for example, if I want to aim at, uh, let's say, Shiva's face, probably not. She's going to duck. Let's say the eye, of, uh, I mean that circled object over there, all right? I'm going to shoot it. See that? It's cool, huh? So you can do like quick aiming, very accurate aiming. So by wiggling the controller, it does the move for the knife. Okay. So, well... That's about it. This is, again, Resident Evil 5 PlayStation Move Demonstration. Thanks for watching by this video reborn. Alright. Cool, huh? You can kill some zombies right now. For example, right now, see that? I can aim low and then wiggle it. Collect. Alright, cool. That is the demonstration again by Video Reborn, Resident Evil 5, GOAT Edition. Alright, thanks for watching. See ya!